Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we had just finally killed her father, Harkon, hey Saran, and now we're just going to go around making sure we looted everything before we are, before we take ourselves out of here. And I highly doubt we missed anything, to be perfectly honest, but... Ew. That's grody. Yeah, I don't think we uh, have that much to gather up. But because 90% of anything that's not on a body is considered stealing. So I won't be able to sell it after the fact. So, whoa. That was weird. <laughs> the head just got pitched for some reason. Anyway see if we looted this one. Yeah, pretty much everything of value was taken so far. Yeah, see, pretty much every item is considered stolen for some reason. Search Alchemist. He's upside down. Ah, that explains it. And I'll take the Nurn route too, why not? That is a weird glitch. Never seen that one before. He's supposed to be Horizontal, not vertical, but all right. Uh, yeah, that's about it for stuff we got in here. Yeah, I think that's as good as it's gonna get. Uh, yeah, let's make some potions. Why not? Give me just a moment. Uh, I think I still have some things. Uh, no. No don't have enough for at least most of them, <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, Gleam Blossom. Huh. I could do that, yeah. Would that make it stronger? No, it would not. Of course not. I would hope it would, but apparently it don't. Eh, it, does, it don't. It doesn't work like that. My brain's still, you know, waking up. I have coffee over here. I was hoping it would work. Apparently not. Uh, damage health poison recipe. Huh. Skeever tail and small antlers. That's one I didn't know. For those. Okay, so skeever tail and small antlers. Okay. There we go. Just keep that there. Because, again, it's considered stealing. And, oh. Yep, even for the nightshade. I was hoping it wasn't, but oh well. Uh, anything left on these ones? Ooh. Gold on this one. Golden lockpicks on this one. Okay, yep. I think we got all that's worthwhile. <laughs> now let's get our asses out of here, huh? I'm gonna finish my coffee in the meantime. There we go. Perfect. Now my brain will be functioning. <laughs> Hopefully. Anyway. <laughs> if I know anything, and usually I don't, it's that my brain will possibly be functioning now. Uh, ooh. Yeah, you got taken out. You got taken out. You... Oh yeah, I killed you. I remember taking your head off. And... This is the last one, and I think I looted him before we got in. Yep. Okay. Yep, we are. We are done with this entire place here. We are done. Where's, where's Serana? Serana! God damn it, woman. Okay, she doesn't want to come, so we're going to go home our own way. Uh, my preview window is acting really weird. I'm just hoping it's recording properly. Uh, where are we supposed to go? There's a thing here. That's a different thing. We have to... No. Don't have to go back to Port Dongard? Huh. So we're actually done with this entire place. Let's head ourselves back home, <laughs> then get ourselves some much-needed rest and well-deserved. 
We've already taken out the dragons, and now we've taken out the vampires. So, yeah, we probably deserve it, <laughs> I'd say. Alrighty. And so far, we're almost done with all the content that we have in Skyrim. And it'll probably be done in time for <laughs> when they release Elder Scrolls VI <laughs> at this point. Uh, this series has gone on for a while, hasn't it? Not that I'm complaining, mind you. I love this game. <laughs> With all its little weird little quirks included. Ooh, that. Okay, that's a courier. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Okay. Let's see here. A note from someone named Calselmo in Markarth. Calselmo. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Alrighty. If you say so. Selmo and Markarth. Oh, yeah, that guy. That guy. What does he want? Uh, Where is that? There it is. Letter from Caselmo. Bring a dwarven bolt to Caselmo. <laughs> a certain dwarven boat from Fort Dongard. I made them, actually. Not sure how such an object came to find itself resting there, but I've been trying to obtain one for my research. If you still have it, or if not, find another one. I would most, I would be most appreciative if you were to bring it to me here in Markarth. I will pay handsomely. Alrighty. Will you take all of mine, or just that one? Nope. I have a thunderbolt. I forgot I didn't... <laughs> I forgot I had that, actually. I'm a little shocked. Alrighty, let me just get some of my wonderful stuff that I've been growing here in my home. And it's getting a little choppy, I know. But that's mainly because my sensitivity's up a little bit. So I need to make sure I'm not accidentally hitting a thing I don't want to. Uh, leaks, yep. Oopsie doodle. Okay, there we are. And there. Alright. Head into our home. Yeah, that preview window is starting to annoy me. <laughs> Don't know what's making it so choppy. Oh, jeez. Well, I'll find out if it's not recording correctly. <laughs> and whatever it is, I will find it and I will be angry. Home. Lucia! Did you bring me anything? Yeah, of course I did. What is it? What is it? Darling little babby. Uh, green apple. There you go. Thanks. <laughs> oh, I wish I had something better, but they like green... The kids like green apples. Lucia, very big fan of green apples. Because it reminds her of where she used to live in... Uh... I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> White run. There we go. <laughs> there we go. That was the thing. Okay. Harkon sword. I want to see how far I can level that up. Yeah, there's a lot of things I can sell now. Holy shit. Odd to see you again, my Thane. Hello, Lydia. Although you threatened me when I got in here. Don't think I didn't hear that, you little shit. Okay, uh, let's look at Harkon's sword, see what it needs to be upgraded. Uh, steel ingot, really? That needs steel? Okay, fair enough. I'm not gonna question it too much. Uh, I never upgraded Oriole's bow. That's why it was so shit. I could have upgraded it and it could have done so much more damage. Oh, Jesus. Oh, gosh. I'm stupid. See how much we could have bumped it? Oh, Jesus. Not a lot, but that's significant. Oh, Jesus. I'm dumb. I am a level of dumb. Okay. At least I uh, know that's the reason why it didn't do as much damage as it should have. 
Okay. Well, uh, that's actually, yeah, that's yeah. equipped. Yeah, Lucia, what's up? I'm gonna put it over uh, here. I'm aware how weapon racks work. There we go. And it will be over here for the rest of time. Okay. Serana, must you? Okay. Run into you. Sorry, but you were in my way. And you were doing it on purpose almost. Okay. Let's see. What else do we need to do in here? Oh, yeah. Cook food. Cook food. Yeah. Uh, I figured I might as well just get stuff done, take care of the house. Because, you know, I've been out gallivanting all over Skyrim, fixing things. I might as well just enjoy myself and be home and get some things done that way. Also show off what uh, things I can do for someone who uh, might be needing to remember things. DDC, I'm looking at you. <laughs> okay. The... There we go. There's where the leaks will go. They're worth their weight in gold for a reason. Uh, yeah, we could go into venison stew. could go into vegetable soup, but I don't have tomatoes. But uh, I will definitely make some venison stews. There we go. Fondue. Yeah, I could do that. I'll put the rest of the cheese wheels away later. Cabbage potato soup. Uh, eh, that does some health, but not a lot. So I don't really want to do that. Uh, what else do I have that I can use? Potato soup. Yeah, I have a lot of salt. Holy shit. Uh, it's like I'm at work. <laughs> okay. Uh, so much salt. Okay. I'm going to dump some of my things now think I could dump my el the uh, Sun Hollowed Elven Arrows now, because I don't need those anymore. Uh, yeah, drop those in here. Uh, or I could sell them. Nah, I'm just gonna keep them here. Uh, yeah. Let's see. What else do I have? Oh, I have these. That's right. I was gonna put them somewhere. Somewhere Bethel. And, damn it, it's already taken by Ulfric stuff. Shit. Okay, well, in that case, Serana, thank you. You're good. Now, uh, that's, I think that's Falkreath Guard. Yep, that's Falkreath, okay. And that one's Bone Armor. Okay, then I guess I will put this one here with this stuff, then I guess I have to. There we are. Ha <laughs> ha! Perfect. That's another enemy I've killed. That one is not an enemy I've killed, rather. <laughs> really? Neither is that one. This side will be the enemies I kill. These sides will be the people I'm aligned with at this point. I guess I could do that. Anyway. Okay. It's all right, Lucia. Don't need to do much. Uh, what was I? Yes. Yes, I remember now. I was going to disenchant a thing. Not much, Lydia. Thank you for asking, though. Okay. There's this that I needed to disenchant. There we are. What do we got here? This one I can sell, actually, instead of doing that. Minor alchemy. I could sell that one instead. Um, hmm. Gold jeweled necklace. When did I make that? I don't think I made it, actually. I think I... Uh, da, 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 da. I... Looted it. That's what it was. I was trying to remember. I, I was like, I couldn't have bought it. Not that stupid. <laughs> Buying something like that. What, is, what would be wrong with me if I did that? Bunch of... Raider Soul Gems. Uh, I have a bunch of these. I might as well use one of them. There we go. There we go. That's good. 
How? Where's? Oh, I put them in here. That's right. So I have a whole bunch of these at this point, and I'm pretty sure they're a good portion of my weight. Uh, yep. I need to knock those out of those gems. So, we'll work on that next. Act actually. Let's take these and put them away. Uh, okay, I have a lot of this shit. Good lord. Um, store that. Store, 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 store. We have a whole bunch of these. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, now let's do all of that. Keep all of that in there. And... Let's keep seven on us at any given time in case we need to enchant something that we find that's actually really fucking cool. Uh, let's see what we got for lessers. A whole bunch of these ones, so I'm just going to dump most of them. Okay, there we are. That's good. I can dump. There we go. That'll work. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have a whole bunch of petties. Oh, yeah. <laughs> whole bunch of them. Okay, dump all of those. And... There we go. Refilling them won't be too much of a problem, considering I have 22 extras. And, yeah, that's it. That's actually a significant portion of my weight down. Nice. Uh, else do I have that I don't need? Um, huh. Archon Sword, which I'm going to boost up for Serana, so no point in putting that away. Oh! Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to deal with those. We need to head back to Fort Dongard for that. Do it right after I'm done with this place. This place being my home. And this shit's you Uh... They don't really need it that much anymore, right? Because <laughs> I can just sell that. Right? Okay. I'm going to go back to Dawnguard. Well, Fort Dawnguard. And deal with at least two of those scrolls right off the bat because I don't need the scrolls anymore at this point at least I don't think so if I do then shit uh, that won't work but I should be able to I should be able to offload them hmm. that is an ugly looking dragon look at that <laughs> Alrighty. Hopefully we can head out there real quick. But first things first, I want to make sure I have steel in here. Okay. No, I do not. I do have Crundum Ore, though. So I could make steel if I wanted to. Okay. Anything else I can drop in here? At least not too much. Okay. Let's head back to Dawnguard. I, I'm still unable to speak correctly, so I apologize. There we go. And then the last one needs to go to, I think, the College of Winterhold, if I remember correctly. So, yeah, that'll probably do all of them. The Lady Stone. Okay. Cloak spells around the catch caster with a dangerous aura that harms anyone that gets too close. I was trying to say dangerous and caster at the same time. That was where I failed. Okay. Get in here and we talk to Dexian next. Alright. Again, another load screen. Oh boy. I hope that's one thing that they fix when they, you know, do 
<laughs> Elder Scrolls 6 that these long load screens are dealt with. At least for the console version. I know Fallout 4, they've done something better with them. It's not by much, though. Oh, there we go. Back's in. Once again, the Elder Scrolls have proven their value. That they have. They have served me well. Of course they did. I never doubted for a moment. If I may ask, what will you do with them now? I have no idea, to be perfectly honest. They're bound to bring me fortune and glory. Uh, they're indestructible, so they make good armor. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be completely stupid. Nah, they're bound to bring me fortune and glory. Ah, yes. Hmm. I'm afraid they don't quite work that way. Are you sure about that? Might I offer an alternative. I'd very sure. much like Why to not? have those scrolls. Would you? Someday I may be able to return them to their rightful place in the Imperial City. Really? How do you feel about turning them over to me? Uh, six, six thousand gold and they're yours. Yeah, it's, it'd say so, considering it's those two. So... Yeah. Oh my, that's... Well, that's not exactly what I had in mind. Okay. Still, if it means they're safekeeping, I suppose it is worth it. There you this go. This has certainly I need been something out quite of it. the adventure, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. It has been. Nice meeting you, and farewell, Dexian. Do not think I'll see you again. Can you imagine? A world without a sun. Mm. We would all have been doomed, vampires and men alike. Fair enough. Yeah, that, that would have... That would have been bad. Then again, aren't you blind right now? So, it wouldn't have affected you too much. Uh, that's probably not the nicest thing to say. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay. Someone's going to be screaming, Ableist, in the comments. Anyway, I think I'm going to end the episode here right now before I offend more people. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so it can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games for you.